Fetty Wap was arrested at Rolling Loud by the feds for allegedly distributing or helping to distribute fentanyl, cocaine, and heroin. The feds claim that Fetty Wap and several others smuggled drugs from the West Coast to the East Coast via USPS vehicles with secret compartments. It's said that 16 keys of cocaine, two kilos of heroin, fentanyl pills, 1.5 in cash, and handguns was obtained during the investigation. The feds grabbed him before his performance at Rolling Loud and he's scheduled to see the judge today. His lawyer says it's a misunderstanding that holds he gets released to clear things up. Instead of convicted, they could face life in prison. No reps from his team have made any statements. Ten members of the rapper ESTG's Everybody Shines Together was arrested by the FBI in an operation called Project Safe Neighborhood. His business partner and manager was also grabbed up in the sting. Cocaine, guns, a stolen vehicle, and 160,000 in cash was recovered. If convicted, the members could get 10 to 15 years. The FBI and several other agencies made the bust and said that they're tired of the gang's disregard for citizens and said that they're after any other gangs who continue to operate. ESTG wasn't arrested and hasn't spoken on the incident. NBA Youngboy is finally home and released a picture and was trending because the internet said he came home looking like Rich the Kid. He was released on a $1.5 million bail. He's on house arrest with a GPS monitor and he can only have three approved visitors at a time and no visitors between 9 p.m. and 7 a.m. He can have his home built studio and doesn't have to have that ex-military security team watching over him. Stay tuned for more news.